My name is David Ross Russell. Uh, I am a 57 year old physician. I was born in England and have lived in America for the last 30 years. This is my wife, Dorothy, my daughter, Rebecca. I have had an incredibly lucky gifted life. I've been pulling aces off the top of the deck until the age of 57. Uh, until the day after Thanksgiving, when uh, I received a diagnosis of stage four pancreatic cancer. Uh, I still consider myself incredibly lucky uh, because I've had such a rich life. However, uh, there is something that I've been involved with for a number of years that is also extremely important and has a future. And that is the organization, The Small Things, that has been set up and is run by my daughter, Rebecca. It is an organization in Tanzania that looks to uh, improve the future of children who are born mainly as orphans, uh, their mothers dying in childbirth, or for other reasons abandoned by families, or where the families are unable to cope. They are doing incredible work, both in an orphanage and a children's village, but more importantly than anything, in their family preservation unit. So when we found out about David's diagnosis, David and I had a long talk about, you know, how do you make meaning out of something like this? It's a very difficult thing to do. And the one thing he really wanted to do was to make sure that the small things has a good future. We are, we helped to found the organization. We're major donors to the organization. We're both on the board. And so it's really important to us to see this go on and to see our daughter grow and thrive with, with the small things. Since day one, you know, my, my dad, uh, my parents came out to visit and they've always been, you know, the number one cheerleaders for this community and for helping to uh, extend opportunities to these really just amazing, vibrant, happy, wonderful kids um, who who deserve bright futures and who are who are willing to do everything it takes to get there if they're just given the chance. And um, I couldn't be more honored or grateful that even with all of this going on this is what's on you know forefront of my dad's mind but uh you know this is one thing that we can we can do that can make a real difference um, we support already over 150 kids um, over 50 living with us full time at the orphanage and children's village as well as about 100 in the community with their families and we have the potential to really just change so many more lives um, as we keep growing. So I'm really grateful that this is not going to be the end uh, of that, you know, that we're really going to keep keep trying to make the world a better place in, in his honor. Thank, Thank you. Thank you so much. Thank you.